customers can expect a little less bang for their buck this year. There's a firework shortage. Ben Muzzy, the sales manager of Spirit of 76 Fireworks in Boone County, Missouri, says they weren't able to get as many fireworks as normal. In a given year, we'll typically see uh, anywhere from 92 to like 95% fulfillment from our suppliers on our master orders. And this year, we're going to be somewhere between 65 and 70% fulfillment on our master orders. Record-breaking sales in 2020 exhausted retailers' inventory, putting more pressure on manufacturers, especially overseas. And shipping is a challenge, too. Costs have doubled. There used to be a lot more vessels available, ocean vessels pre-pandemic, that were making the long voyage to the United States from China. And so when there aren't as many vessels, everybody's fighting for that same limited amount of cargo space. There are still fireworks to buy. They're just more expensive. We've got stuff, but I don't have the stuff that I would need to replace this. I'd rather do red, white, and blue, but $16.99 a pop. John and Daniel Weibel are visiting from yeah. Indiana. Daniel's dad has been shooting fireworks for about 15 years. So I do a private show every year, and I usually spend about $1,500 to $2,000. This week, I've been into 10 stores. His son plays football. I was planning on uh, doing fireworks at our next football game. So I'm trying to get something to make it pop. And I can't find none of the stuff I used to shoot. We could have got 250 shoots for 80 bucks yeah. in Kansas. I cannot even grasp a hold of how expensive fireworks have gotten. I think most people when they shop, they go in with a budget. So they know they're gonna spend $200, say, for their backyard fireworks. This year, they're just gonna get a little bit less than what they would have gotten a year ago. Stephanie Sandoval, Newsy.